Jeez, I do need a haircut. Starting to get a little bit shaggy, but it's Sunday afternoon football from Alice Springs, and we're going to be live streaming it. Um, so I've got it set up. I've got about 15 minutes till we're live. So I've got a little bit of work to do, but really excited for this clash. And um, it's a huge one. The D's need to get the chockies if we want to stay in that top two and sort of keep that gap on the rest of the eight. So massive clash, but um, let's set the room up. Just getting into the live stream now. It's quarter time and the D's battling a little bit with their connection. I feel like we've been the better side across the ground, but um, connection wise, we just can't link up, but that's okay. I feel like that's something you can nut out throughout the game. Some of the contest airily, we need to be, we're not dominant, but we need to break even at least. That's um, that's also Halfway for through sure. the last, Ben Brown lining up directly in front to give the D's a nice little lead. <laughs> and it's out to 20 odd points. Come on. The D's are home in a brutal match at Alice Springs. We've got the chockies, we've got the job done. The chat's going boona nas. It's just been an all round great result because of picket six goals. Great performance and we're back on the winners list. Happy days. Monday morning and it's literally never been colder. I think, what What are we, odds? What, what's the temp gonna be? I think it's six at the minute. Yeah, I reckon seven. Well, that's Geelong, but we're not in Geelong because we're doing the pod. Maybe that's a bit of a sea breeze. We're both wrong. Well, yeah. Close enough. Um, going in today, no guest and no co-host. Roggie is sick. We're not sure whether he's coming in. We don't have word on him yet. How are you feeling about being back on? Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo! <laughs> I'm up and about today. <laughs> I'm up and about today and I'm feeling really big. The boys had one Yay. coffee and he's off to the races. I'm heading into the Richmond chiropractor to get a little back check before we hit the <laughs> podcast because those chairs, I don't know. Melbourne, how you feeling? How you feeling? So, guests out. That's fine. We can adapt. We're like water. We mould into any conditions and any confinement that we're in. Um, guest out. Rog back in. He went to the respiratory clinic this morning and he's still got I think he kicked the cough potentially in the last 24 hours. So Roger's in clutch because I thought I was going to have to do a whole show without a guest and without a co-host. But um, we're back on and we're excited. And I'm up for a big week. Maybe it's the coffee talking Baz, but I want to film the video music clip. Might fire up a bit of a career. Let us know in the comments down below whether you want a new career mode on AFL Evo. And yeah, big things are coming. I think it might be the coffee. It might be the coffee. It's two hours, I'm crashing. Just <laughs> my motivation. Can be a little bit up and down, but that's okay. Roger Berto is back, baby. I am back. I wish I could say better than ever, but I'm on the mend, but not quite that good. Um, missed last week, was a bit of a late out, and it looks certain to be a one week sort of omission. Um, back next week, but as it got closer and we were doing the fitness test throughout the week, it became more evident that this is going to be right down to the wire. And to be honest, the flip of the coin, I was certain it wasn't going to land in my favour. But we woke up this morning, went into a resp respiratory clinic specialist, and uh, turns out we're all clear. I'm not dying, I have not got lung disease, and I'm ready to uh, put on a clinic of my own. Not of the respiratory variety, but more of the podcast variety. If I'm going well today You could have any other player The captain of the team Sing it! Why are you talking to me? The only kicks that I get are free Cause you're a bad fucking Back pocket plug. Oh, 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 oh. Cause you're a bad. <laughs> Alright, Tune. Thank you, Port Arlington. Yeah, that is a great song. That is a great song. Potential top five, top three draft pick, Will Ashcroft. Will, thanks for joining us. It goes alright. How was that? Really good. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Uh, good experience. Media game a little bit. Who else have you sort of been chatting to in the media? Have you been on with a Jared Whaley or a Dwayne Russell? Who have you been chatting? Um, I went on 360 
Oh, uh, yeah. AFL Academy game. Yeah. Um, so that was a good experience. And I think uh, the radio stuff will probably pick up a little bit as we go. I haven't done a lot of that yet. Yeah. And how have you pulled up from the weekend? Obviously, it's in the headlines galore. 38 touches, 10 clearances, a billion ambles. Um, how are you feeling after a cold, wet clash down at the Cattery? It's good. Great win uh, for us boys. I think we weren't expecting to probably beat them that badly, but um, yeah, it was really good. Especially with a few of our better players out as well, so it was a good, good result, for sure. And what's it like winning at the Cattery? I'm a Melbourne fan and I don't see that happen too often. <laughs> yeah, it was. I love that ground. I played there last year for Metro as well. So. Uh, everyone said it's pretty skinny, but I don't mind it. I don't mind mm. the, the directional footy, so it's good. Are you going to play any more VFL games for the Lions to finish off this season? A bit more senior footy? There's a couple possibilities and a few buys for the Dragons, so um, yeah, it's definitely a possibility, but we haven't yet thought too far into it. The opposition would be C. You can't allow the Edge Brisbane VFL team expecting that might be a chance of a W day and then back Will Ashcroft's in. Do you want a Warhead? Yes. Oh, thanks for offering. Empty. Oh. Cop that. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, the that. man was ill. He's come back fit and strong, and now we're performing. Will Ashcroft, what a man. Can you do one of those um, um, shots where it's like Melbourne Storm as Kyle Rogers? What, you Half want? back flank. You want one of these? Go. Do the walk up. Connor Rogers. Half back flank. <laughs> Is that <laughs> what they do at the Storm? <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, that was unreal. Um, I've been really interested in the draft. I, I assume it's because I went for Melbourne and we'd have five top 20 draft picks every season. So I'd get pumped for the next crop of young players coming through. Um, but when I finished school, I did TA Sick Up Radio and I was on the boundary line watching, um, it was like Jade Gresham and Braden Fiorini and, and that sort of draft crop come through. So I'm so fascinated by the mindset of someone who's going to play AFL but isn't an AFL player. Like I find that so interesting. I had a ripping chat to Will, he's a great kid and he's going to be a gun.